Horizontal analysis is also called a trend analysis as it shows what happens to each item over time. It is a technique that evaluates a series of financial statement items over some period of time. We apply a horizontal analysis to the income statement and to the balance sheet. The horizontal analysis formula is the value of a certain item at a certain year minus the value of the same item at a base year, which is a fixed year. And this is all divided by the value of the same item at a base year, which is a fixed year as well. Please note that a base year must be normal in the sense that there should be no recession or any price bubble. Let's apply the percentage change form year to year and horizontal analysis to the following example. A company has sales in 2007 of $100 million. Lower sales in 2008 of $40 million due to the global financial crisis and sales in 2009 of $120 million. To compute the percentage change form year to year, we need to use the formula of new minus old divided by old, which means the value of a certain item at a certain year minus the value of the same item in the previous year, all divided by the value of the same item in the previous year. So the percentage change in 2008 is 40 million minus 100 million, all divided by 100 million, which is equal to negative 60%. This means that the company has lower sales by 60% in 2008 compared to the previous year of 2007. Also, the percentage change in 2009 is 120 million minus 40 million, all divided by 40 million, which is equal to 200%. This means that a company has a higher sales by around 200% in 2009 compared to the previous year of 2008. This percentage does not make sense because it does not explain how a firm doubles its sales in one year without acquiring another firm or expanding. This means that this percentage is misleading. This high percentage is due to comparing high sales of 2009 with very low sales in 2008 due to the global financial crisis. The solution is to compare the sales of any year to a fixed year, which we call a base year. This is done in horizontal analysis. So let's write up an example. To compute horizontal analysis, we need to use the formula of the value of a certain item at a certain year minus the value of the same item at a base year, all divided by the value of the same item at a base year. So the percentage change in 2008 is 40 million minus 100 million, all divided by 100 million, which is equal to negative 60%. This means that the company has lower sales by 60% in 2008 compared to the base year of 2007. Also, the percentage change in 2009 is 120 million minus 100 million, all divided by 100 million, which is equal to 20%. This means that a company has higher sales of 20% in 2009 compared to the base year of 2007. This percentage change makes sense as it is reasonable that sales grow by 20% without acquiring another firm or expanding, for example. This means that the horizontal analysis is more accurate when we have a recession or a boom compared to a percentage change form year to year.